Gary Harris Jr. in charge of the start. Watch for a green one as they arrive. Off and racing, Gary Harris Jr. on the inside of Neil Caldoulas. Caldoulas fights back high on the racetrack, trying to get back on groove, but we got him three wide going through the canteen corner. Steve Spencer's one of them on the inside and on the middle, Bryce Bayfield. Bayfield fights back on the middle of the racetrack, finds his groove, gets himself into position number two. They're chasing Gary Harris. Bryce Bayfield in two. Steve Spencer's in three. Down on the inside of him comes uh, Neil Caldoulas to go back into position number three as uh, Hutchie calls it quits and pulls on to the inside. Charlotte Christensen would be the next one. Then we've got Hayden Turner. One in trouble is the 71 car of Steve Spence pulls out of this one. Gary Harris down the main straight away he goes. Still to the better of Bryce Bayfield as car number 22. Charlotte Christensen turns it around, coming on to the main straight away. <laughs> and had our flag man running. Gary Harris Jr. Bryce Bayfield, Neil Caldoulas, Hayden Turner. Richard Cook is the one on the outside, right up high on the concrete, looking for the drive up there. Gary Harris bounces it through, turns three and four. Bryce Bayfield is in position number two. Neil Caldoulas gets it way offline and uh, drops right back through into the clutches of Hayden Turner. Richard Cook would be the next one in there. And then we've got the 61 car of Ricky Ingham. Next one there is Scott Duffy. But at the moment, Gary Harris Jr. showing them a clean pair of heels as he goes through the canteen corner and down the main straightaway. Bryce Bayfield in two. Neil Caldoulas with a bit of smoke coming out of the back of the car has got Hayden Turner right on his hammer. Turner comes down the inside and I think maybe Neil Caldoulas might have some uh, mechanical worries as he slots in behind. Richard Cook would be the next one in there and then Ricky Ingham as their race leader up on the tail of the field. Gary Harris to the outside of Selena Jennings. Puts a lap on her as Neil Caldoulas and uh, Richard Cook come together down the main straight away and it's Richard Cook who bounces it off the concrete. Bryce Bayfield goes around Selena Jennings as well. Hayden Turner there in position number three. He goes around the outside. Neil Caldoulas is still in the mix with Richard Cook. We pick up our race leader with nine laps remaining as he goes through under the tower. Gary Harris to the better of oh, Bryce Bayfield. Back then we go to Hayden Turner, Neil Caldoulas and Richard Cook. Next run through would be uh, Ricky Ingham. Our race leader under the tower one more time. Got the length of the main straight away as his lead at the moment. Over Bryce Bayfield. Hayden Turner would be the next one in front of Richard Cook. Neil Caldoulas in trouble. High on the boards in the 17 car. Allows car number 61, Ricky Ingham, to go by as well. And maybe some problems with the 17 car. Back then we go to car number 20. 26, Scott Duffy has the rest of the field go by. Our race leader is now right up in the big pack. The first one there in front of him will be Darren Reed. So race leader now has got to negotiate them in the lap traffic as he goes down the main straight away with five laps remaining. Gary Harris. Bryce Bayfield is still there. Hayden Turner in position number three. A bit of panel damage then on the uh, Richard Cook car. As we've got 
Car number 37 parked up against the fence. Can't get it out of the race, off the race track. We've got five to go. So this will bring everyone back together. Seven to go. Outside the witches had single file. Go says Gary Harris. Chasing him is Bryce Bayfield. Tucked in there too is Hayden Turner down low on the track. Next one behind him is Richard Cook with the uh, Ricky Ingham car having a little look down the inside as they put one more lap down on the journey. It's Ricky Ingham down lower on the track. Gary Harris, Jr. down the back straight away. Bryce Bayfield still not too far away. Aidan Turner almost overdoes things down the, through turns three and four. Holds on to position number three. We've got Richard Cook on the outside, Ricky Graham down on the inside as they go down the back straight away and then Neil Caldoula's back at the front of the field. It's Gary Harris Jr. versus Bryce Bayfield with only a couple of laps remaining. Down the back straight away for Gary Harris. Bryce Bayfield is still there and has a little look on the outside as the bumps sort them out as they take the white flag. So Gary Harris has got one lap. Down the back straight away he goes. Gary Harris, Bryce Bayfield. Gary Harris into the canteen corner for the last time. Bryce Bayfield can't do it. Gary Harris, Bryce Bayfield. Hayden Turner. In front of uh, Ricky Graham it would have been Richard Cook gets the car across the line with a uh, few sparks flying. Well done, Gary Harris, Jr. Two feature races in a row, Bundy feature and Maryborough feature. Gary Harris will get his lap of honour. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for uh, being here tonight at Fraser Shores, Maribara Speedway. It's great to have your company. Hopefully uh, we'll see you again next time. But put your hands together for him as he gets his lap of honour. Gary Harris, Jr. Trying to stamp a bit of authority in the production sedan ranks. And as he does his lap of honour, it's good night from me. And it's good night from him. Drive home safely, everyone. We'll see you back here next time.